Want to speak real Danish from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at danishclass101.com. You are aboard an express train where you're about to arrive at your next destination. Suddenly, the train slows and comes to an unexpected stop clearly short of the station. There are no instructions from the conductor. Concerned, you pick up and read the emergency instructions pamphlet aboard the train. According to the pamphlet, what should you do in this situation? According to the pamphlet, what should you do in this situation? The pamphlet says that you should not attempt to exit the train because the train tracks are electrified. Instead, you should stay seated and wait for help to arrive. Blive siddende og vente på hjælpen ankommer. You are at a train station platform where you are waiting for your train. There's a small pamphlet sitting on a display case about a new train that will be introduced next year. You decide to pick up and read the pamphlet. What is the main feature and the biggest advantage of the new train? What is the main feature and the biggest advantage of the new train? The main feature of the train is that it is propelled by magnetism. The biggest advantage is that it can reach twice the speeds of any train that runs on tracks. Drevet magnetisme, det kan nå dobbelt hastighed af et hvert tog, der kører på skinner. You just got off the train at the closest station to your friend's new house, where he's invited you to a party. Which exit should you use to get to your friend's new house? Which exit should you use to get to your friend's new house?
Although the east exit would have normally been the closest exit, it's currently under construction, so you should take the south exit instead. Take udgang syd. You are at a train station where you're heading to the lost and found office to retrieve a lost passport. According to an email you received from the train company, what things do you need to provide to the staff? What things do you need to provide to the staff? The email says that you need to present proof of identification and to pay a small fee. Legitimation, betale et lille gebyr. You are exiting a train station when a big notice posted on the bulletin board catches your attention. The notice highlights permanent changes made to the train schedule. How will trains on Fridays be affected? How will trains on Fridays be affected? Trains on Fridays will now start at 6 a.m. and will end at 1 a.m. Starter med at køre klokken 6.00 og stopper klokken 1.00. Suddenly, you get bad abdominal pain and decide to buy some medicine. What are the instructions regarding the recommended dosage on the label? What are the instructions regarding the recommended dosage on the label? The label says that daily dosage, two pills per day after eating, Daglig dosis. To piller per dag efter måltid. Your condition is not getting better, and you decide to go to the nearby clinic. You receive a medical report. What is the diagnosis?
You receive a medical report. What is the diagnosis? The diagnosis is food poisoning caused by contaminated food. Madforgiftning for salg af forurenet mad. You just bought a few items from a local shop online. What information does the website say about the delivery date? What information does the website say about the delivery date? The website says that Delivery dates differ depending on the delivery method, but all dates should be calculated from the next working day. Leveringsdatoer varierer afhængigt af leveringsmåden, men alle datoer udregnes fra den næste arbejdsdag. The day after ordering an item online, you receive an email notification. How can you track your package? How can you track your package? The email says that you can track your package on this website by logging into your account, and after logging in, click on your order history and enter the order number found in this email. Du kan spore din pakke på denne hjemmeside ved at logge ind på din konto. Efter du er logget ind, klik på din orderhistorik og indtast ordrenummeret, som findes i denne e-mail. You're reading the instructions of an electronic device you've just bought. What should you do in case of overheating?
What should you do in case of overheating? The manual says that if you notice the surface overheating, unplug the device immediately and allow it to cool down before handling again. Hvis du bemærker at overfladen bliver overophedet, frakobl straks enheden og lad den køle ned, inden der rører svinden igen. Want to speed up your language learning? Take your very first lesson with us. You'll start speaking in minutes and master real conversations. Sign up for your free lifetime account. Just click the link in the description.